Please wait while I verify your identity. Identity confirmed. Please proceed. Hello, and welcome to the Counter-Terrorist Special Training Facility. Please proceed to the elevator. They are waiting for you in the training areas. I'm sorry, I'm busy now. I need to get back to work. The training here is pretty intense. Training course is just ahead. Greetings, operative. The first moves you will practice are related to basic movement. Press your duck key to navigate under these obstacles. Good. You will now need to jump up on these boxes to proceed. To enter this bend, you will need to perform a duck jump. Stand directly in front of the vent and continue to press forward. Then jump, and while you're in the air, press your duck key. Good job. To descend on this ladder, simply walk directly into the ladder. Look down and continue moving forward. these pipes by walking directly into them while continuing to press forward. Jump into this tank of water and swim through the pipe below. To swim, simply look in the direction you want to swim and press forward. Watch your air supply closely while swimming. If you need to surface for air, an oxygen icon will light up on your display. out of here. Let's get the hell out of here. Thanks. I'll stay here. Let's get the hell out. I owe you my life. Leave this civilian to the security panel near the door. Right. He will bypass the security and allow you to proceed. fire range. Here you will receive training in firing weapons, reloading, mode switching, accuracy, and finally explosives. Pick up your weapons and proceed to the firing station. If you run out of ammo, step to the ammo window for additional magazines. Also try to reload during pauses rather than running out of ammunition at a critical time. 
Okay, squeeze off a few rounds to get a feel for your weapon. Notice that when you fire, your crosshair expands with each shot. The size of the crosshair represents the accuracy of your weapon. The wider the crosshair, the less accurate your shots will be. To be effective in the field, use short controlled bursts to ensure accurate targeting. Engage three targets to continue. To switch firing modes on your weapon, press the secondary fire key. Engage all the targets to continue. Good job! Time to change weapons. Pick up your next weapons and proceed to the firing station. All sniper rifles can zoom in on a target using the secondary fire key. Engage all the targets to continue. explosive grenade. Toss the grenade at the target to continue. But Finally, pick up the flashbang and smoke grenade. Flashbangs temporarily blind enemies, but if you look at it when it explodes, you'll be blinded as well. Turning away from flashbangs when they're about to explode will limit the blinding effect. Smoke grenades also temporarily affect your enemy's ability to accurately attack. Very useful in crowded firefight situations. Your offensive weapons training is complete. Please advance to the next area. In, team. And Kevlar armor is essential to your survival in the field. Pick up your armor and proceed to the hazards area. When you pass through fire or steam, you will see a heat damage icon light up. Directional indicators at the center of your display show you where damage is coming from. Tech. 
tactical situations without revealing yourself to potential threats. Pick up the fiber optic camera and use it in the fiber optic zone to see what lies on the other side of that door. Use your fiber optic camera to sneak past the guard in the next area. If you're spotted, don't worry, you'll be able to try again. Take notice of the stealth icon while you're in dark areas in this room. Anytime you're in a stealth zone, enemies cannot see you and will not attack or alert others. area to continue. Since night vision will not always be available, some weapons are equipped with attached flashlights. Pick up the shotgun and press your secondary fire key to activate the flashlight. Navigate the flashlight area to continue. terrorist teammates from the field. Pick up the radio and use it in the radio zone. Let's move. Finally, you'll need to know how to defuse explosive devices. This bomb has gone live. Moving Body into cover. position. To defuse the bomb, walk up to it, face the device, then press and hold your use key. Excellent. The device has been diffused. Congratulations. You've completed the counter-terrorist special training course. Please return topside for processing. 